night may be Halloween, but in San Francisco's Castro District, the party has been going on for four days for the first time in 17 years. The festivities used to be huge until 2006 when a fight between two groups erupted in gunfire, shutting down the celebration. Betty Yu shows us it was a much different scene tonight. Crowds in the Castro this Halloween are festive and lively, yet manageable. It's something that longtime businesses and residents say they welcome. Edward Scissorhands, a minion, and multiple Barbies flooded the Castro on Halloween. We ran into San Francisco native Morticia Adams and her granddaughter Wednesday, who just wrapped up trick or treating with their tradition a stop at Hot Cookie. Four or five years ago, it wasn't as lively as it is now. And I think people are that resurgence of hope is coming back to the Castro for Halloween. And I love all the people. I love that the, shop, the stores are open. I'm just loving all the activity. Several restaurants and bars were bustling following a successful weekend of family friendly activities organized by the Castro Merchants Association. The group brought back the festivities after a long hiatus. I graduated high school in 87. So yeah, from 83 onwards, this was a spot. In its heyday, Halloween in the Castro was a massive party in the streets. The city and organizers shut it down after a mass shooting in 2006 that injured nine people. Lizzie Deerkin has lived in the city for 30 years and used to attend the annual party before violence broke out. That was so fun. Um, but oh, with that comes a lot of uh, things. I've had such a great time this Halloween. It's felt really refreshing and light and people are just local and having a great time. Halloween has brought increased business for the district. Definitely better than last year. Um, again, it depends on the day Halloween lands on, but I mean, we're on a Tuesday and we're packed. There's ups and downs no matter what we're going through, you know, but I'd say right now we're going through a steady up. We're, we're coming back up. Hello, San Francisco. Happy Halloween. <laughs> We saw plenty of SFPD officers on virtually every corner. There were no major incidents to report. And by the looks of it, Wednesday approves of the night. Give her your best Wednesday stare. <laughs> The Civic Joy Fund pledged to spend over $100,000 to reimburse Castro merchants that hosted Halloween events. 